In this video, I want to talk to you about the Juki DX7 computerized sewing machine. The DX7 is one of the top of the line machines within the Juki line. Great quality machine, loaded out with features and accessories. So let's give you a brief overview of this machine. The DX7 is going to give you over 280 built-in sewing stitches. Of those stitches, you get all kinds of garment construction stitches. You get the one-step button holes that are built in several quilting stitches, old-timey feather stitch, several applique stitches that are built into the machine, and you'll get a, a lot of decorative stitches built into this particular machine. We can mirror image the stitch, so when I get to the decorative stitches, if I want to mirror image those, that kind of helps us actually double the capacity of what this machine can do. Our computer board is laid out really nice and easy for me. Everything on our planogram that's built in on the machine lid. All I have to do is match what mode I'm in and then type in the number of the stitch that I want to sew out. And the machine is going to pull that up for me. I have the toggle dials that I can dial the stitch width up to 7 millimeters on my stitch width. Now this particular machine will have a lot larger motor in it than your average machine. It can handle things as heavy as eight layers of denim. We can sew vinyl and upholstery material as we'll demonstrate in a moment. And the feed dog system that's built into it has the box feed system. So it's going to actually touch the fabric in seven places. And the motion of those feed dogs will really help on lighter weight materials. Feed that through reducing the likelihood of those puckering. I do have a built-in place for a knee lift. I can raise and lower my pressure foot so I can keep my hands on the fabric and use my right leg to actually raise and lower that pressure foot. The computer controls on the machine really do make this machine a, a notch above. You do have the ability to raise and lower your pressure foot right here. I do have the built-in needle up, needle down feature on this machine that I can stop the machine out of the fabric with the needle out of the fabric or I can stop the needle in the fabric. It does have the push button scissor, so I can snip that bobbin and top thread for me. I will have the speed adjuster here, so I can override if I'm using a foot control. I can override the speed of that, or if I just want to use my start stop button and not worry with the foot control, I can back the speed down or up, depending on what I'm doing. This particular model does have the automatic tension setting, though I can override that if I want to. I typically leave that on automatic and it's going to allow you to sew things as heavy as several layers of denim all the way down to see-through batiste material and you're not going to be having to adjust that. If you ever do encounter stitch problems feel free to be in front of your machine and give us a call we can walk you through things over the phone on that. Now the machine will also give you channel threading all the way down to my needle so make sure that you get the thread in your tension for you there's enough thread guides here we have a built-in needle threader to help thread our needle we have the removable accessory tray and that exposes our free arm also exposes our feed dog where I can drop the feed dogs if I'm doing free motion or say I'm putting on a button or darning a hole but having my free arm exposed I can hem pant legs or shirt sleeves with ease it will come with a lot of accessories and I keep all those accessories right here nice and neat and I like how the door opens toward you so I can see what's down in here. And I have all these little cavities to store all my accessories. Keep everything nice and neat and organized. This machine is super durable. I will have extra high lift under my presser foot. So if I raise that presser foot up, notice how I've got that extra high lift. So here is eight layers of denim that I'm able to easily get underneath my needle. We'll sew through that. Hit my start stop button. I'm doing a, actually a feather stitch right here. So there's several stitches going into this garment. We're going to show you the power of having this top drop-in bobbin system. Because what it's going to allow me to do when I go from a thick uh, fabric down to a thinner material, it's going to actually crawl down onto that. And because I've got the automatic tension setting, it's sensing that for me. And I have control over my fabric, so if I want to move that over, and then I could go into the stretch material. We're going to show you going from extreme heavy to extremely lightweight. How the machine with the box feed can handle doing that, the automatic tension setting. 
We'll tie that stitch off for us. It has the auto lock feature. You'll love the scissor that's built in. And when you're finished snipping, it's gonna raise that presser foot up for you. So I went from extremely heavy, eight layers of denim, to a cotton, to my stretch material. Now this here is a vinyl, like if you're doing a boat seed or redoing a car seed, a post tree. I'm gonna do four layers of this. Now this is a slicky material. It's kind of spongy with that backing that's on it. Notice again how I'm able to raise that pressure foot up. This is the beauty part about having the box feed system. I'm gonna stay on the same briar stitch. So there's a lot of stitching going into this. Four layers of this material. It's feeding it through without a problem whatsoever. My hand's just keeping it straight. And we'll tie that stitch off right there. And I'll hit my scissor when it's finished tying it off and raise that presser foot up for me. And I've went through all that material with no problem whatsoever. Ken Sewing Center is your authorized GQ dealer. We can help you with any question that you may have about this machine. Feel free to check out our website as we have a lot more information there with other images and other information of what all comes with the machine. We have technicians in-house that can help you with any kind of question or if you feel like you're having a problem with your machine. If you need to know how to operate, I have several educators that will be glad to help you anytime and other salespeople. So feel free to reach out by email or give us a call.